Okay, so we are going to open up the patient's original image just by going back and we're going to find the CT scan and double click. Now this one has the implant so it might not be accurate so we may have to open up this one which is probably the one when the model was taken. Let me close that. So we're going to open that one instead and you can see that's only a partial scan. It's better to have this larger scan so it matches the model size instead of this one. So we're going to open this because we think it's more accurate to the model that we just took. If we had a new model that matched this, then we'd want this one to match it. So you want the same model as the same CT scan when you're going to combine them for use. So once this is open, then we're going to end up going up to the top to the main menu. And in the main menu, it's going to be export. When you click export, you're going to send it to the USB drive again. So it should be coming up in a second. Okay, so it's up. So we go up to main menu, export, and this window pops open. So we want to do lossless. Local disk allows us to choose somewhere local, which is to this computer. So then we go over here to the USB drive again, and we're going to select that as the folder, and it just starts saving it, and then you're done.